Alright, this is a two minute tutorial from Mark Dickinson Photography. I just wanted to show you guys how to edit with palette sliders. If you haven't seen these already, these are palette sliders from uh, palettegear.com and they work phenomenal. So let's jump right into it. We're going to get right into this particular photo here. It is reset back to zero and I want to just do a little bit of editing into it. I'll put some contrast in there and then I'm going to turn my highlights down just a little bit and shadows up. And on top of that, I want to tone this down just a little bit and I want to take some of the magentas out of it. Don't want to take too much. Probably about negative five. Um, and as you can see, I'm not using my mouse to edit as I would be over here, so it looks really easy to do. Uh, a couple of the other things that you can do is you can you can instantly jump into crop, like I'm doing there. So I'm going to escape to get out of that. I have a crop button. I have um, temperature, tent, and also flag and approve. So let's stick with this image right here. I'm going to say that this will be fine for me. I'm going to prove it. But I got this black and white image right here that I like that I did just another side of it. I want to go back to this one and show you how I do that. I have one button that's up here that you can probably see. This is my create virtual copy. And then my black and white treatment. It applies it right to it. And now I can come in and if you look at the settings, they've all reset. So I'm going to bring my shadows in just a little bit. And I'll turn my blacks down. And then exposure up just a little bit. And then we'll call that the black and white. The other black and white that you see to the right has a little bit more uh, done to it. And I did that uh, just the other day. And I have another preset for that. But this is how you will do uh, editing with the Lightroom sliders. Really easy, fast way to do it. When you're done, hit approve. Go to the next one. And if you like that one already, we'll go there. Now this one has just a little bit of a crop that I want to straighten on it. And as I did before, I just turn this button ever so slightly and crop. Now the reason why you're seeing my screen flicker is because I'm importing <clears throat> and also recording the screen in as well on the other side of here. So that's how you do a two minute tutorial with the slider palettes from Palette Gear. Uh, each one of these modules are amazing. They can do anything that you want to in Lightroom. So you can appreciate it. Check out our blog at markjacksonphotography.com slash blog or click the link down below.